Hi, welcome to another Honest video. And today we're talking nails um, because I have had a dramatic turnaround um, in the strength and length of my nails. And I wanted to, to share with you my theory on, um, on what's gone right. I mean, I always in my teens and 20s had really strong, healthy nails. Um, and I was just always filing them down to keep them from getting too long. But I think that's probably started to change in my 30s. And in my 40s, um, it's gone spectacularly wrong. It's quite a lot that goes wrong in your 40s, let's face it. Um, but they were really short, breaking regularly and flaking. They were sort of peeling nails. And um, I don't know why I hadn't uh, thought about doing something about this earlier on, but I think it was just something that I happened over time and I got used to it and I didn't really think about it. However, um, earlier this year, right at the start of the year, I shared a video about um, having dry eyes. And um, one of the things I'd found out in my research was that taking um, fish oils uh, would be would be helpful for dry eyes. So I'll share the link to that video. If you're a dry eye sufferer, check it out. So I started taking these um, cod liver oil capsules in January, and they have um, they, that includes vitamin D and A, uh, which cod liver oil is um, naturally high in omega threes and has uh, vitamin D and A. So um, I have been taking these every day uh, since January. Um, it's now uh, September. So a good while. And um, I would say in the last couple of months, I've noticed this astonishing turnaround in my nails. Now, I also got my parents who are in their 70s into taking this as well because of the pandemic, because there's been a lot around about um, the importance of taking vitamin D at, regardless of the time of year. I mean, we're often in the UK, it used to be we were recommended to take vitamin D supplements in the autumn and winter months. We are now being recommended to take that daily throughout the year. Um, and there have been studies, they've been changeable, but the bulk of the evidence is moving towards vitamin D having uh, an important role in our immune systems and, um, you know, possibly in the fight against coronavirus. Um, so that's why it's really important to take it at the moment. So I told my mum and dad to get onto these a few months ago as well. And they have both independently reported to me um, that their nails are much stronger and healthier. Uh, which is really interesting. So, I mean, let's break it down then, why this may be helpful um, in strengthening our nails and why it's a good thing to take more generally. So we know that vitamin D is um, important for the body's immune system and it also uh, helps promote healthy bones and teeth because of the way it helps the body absorb calcium. Um, but there are also studies showing, interestingly, that peeling nails are a sign of vitamin D deficiency. And that certainly seems to have been the case for me. If I'm quoting from the Live Strong website here, it says, not only does vitamin D itself appear to play a role in maintaining nail integrity, the nutrient is necessary for proper calcium absorption and to regulate the concentration of the mineral in your blood. Calcium is also required for nail health. Peeling nails may indicate that low vitamin D is affecting your calcium level. Previous studies indicate that fingernail thickness can correlate with the levels of vitamin D um, in your blood. So um, the scientists have even suggested that uh, for older people, brittle nails may be a sign of low vitamin D. So we begin to get a picture of um, of just how wide a role vitamin D can play in our bodies. And then there's the omega-3 fatty acids. I mean, let me show you the capsule that I take every day. It's quite big, you know, it's not for the faint hearted. If you're one of those that's, that finds capsules, just, well, find a smaller capsule because this is a hulk of a capsule here. Um, but it certainly contains a lot of fish oil. And um, just as that can help lubricate the eyes, which is why I started out taking it. So it's going to play a beneficial role in moisturizing your nails, keeping your nails moist. I mean, there's another theory that studies have thrown out there 
which is that omega-3 can help reduce um, inflammation in the body and that that anti-inflammatory effect could also have an impact on the nail bed and just improve your nail health on that basis alone. Um, But we know that inflammation in the body is not a good thing. So anything that helps to reduce inflammation is a positive. And there's been lots of independent studies about um, uh, fish oil and omega-3 helping children with ADHD and um, can be beneficial for those with depression and anxiety. So again, um, as a supplement, it is something that um, can have a lot of uses. But the ideal with anything in life is to try and get these things through your diet. So if you're somebody who's eating a lot of oily fish, you probably don't need to take a supplement. But if you don't, um, and I know I don't, um, then that's why I've started on this. So similarly, there's vitamin A in there. It plays uh, an important role in our immune system as well and is thought to be beneficial for eyes and skin. So who knows whether that's played a part in this turnaround. Um, But These capsules I bought for um, about £14 on Amazon. I've included a link as always, so you can have a look for yourself. There's lots more options out there. And if it's only vitamin D on its own that you're looking to take, and again, that's a really good thing to be taking right now, um, you'll find lots of cheaper supplements in this uh, for for vitamin D on its own. This has worked for me um, across a number of levels. It's been helpful for my eyes, it's been helpful for my nails. And hopefully it's helped get my vitamin D levels up. I should say that the recommended dose is 10 micrograms a day of vitamin D in the UK at the moment. And this is five micrograms per capsule. So I may need to up that as we're coming into winter. So I hope you found this video helpful. There's lots more like it on the channel covering everything from product reviews and treatments uh, to household appliances and lots more. So do check it out if you've got time. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.